Hi, welcome back to another episode of... <laughs> I pressed the wrong button. Uh, yeah, welcome back. I'm reading a letter. The cello was killed. Do you mean the celloist? Oh no, no, it's the actual cello. The cello's corpse was found with its bowstrings cut into pieces. I would like for the perpetrator to somehow be found and punished. I will enclose what is known about the day of the incident in this letter. Oh, so this is an actual puzzle. Cool. Oh, oh my god. I'm grateful that these were translated, but Jesus Christ, that's a lot of information. Did this symphony really have a xylophone? That's fucking awesome. An oboe, a flute, a, a clarinet, a, a small ones? A small ones? Are those drums? I guess? Because it because none of them are labeled as drums. There's snare, snare drum, bass drum, and then small ones. That's my favorite instrument. Small ones. Small ones. Okay, so I have to figure out who killed the cello of the other instruments. One of them killed the cello. And fucking sure, whatever. You see, this is the part of the game that I actually enjoy, but, um... Oh, can I just open all the lockers? Nope! I can only open the one that is the murderer. That's how my dog sounds when he wants something. When he wants to go outside, he's like... He's like... He talks. It sounds like he's, like, speaking full sentences sometimes, actually. Um... Is there, like, talking? Yeah. There's, like, ghosts in the seats or something. Oh, look at that. This is how you solve the mystery. Alright, so... Um... I guess I could at least tell you a hint, maybe? Yeah. I do care. Very, very much so. My guess is the perpetrator is not next to the victim. Why? Well, I have no obligation to tell you that. I'll just say this, I'm credible. More like incredible, wait. Wait. If credible, if credible means like you are, like your information is believable, then why, why is incredible a good thing? Is that like just slang or whatever? A murder you say, oh dear. I saw it, I saw it, I saw the cello being killed. About the perpetrator, do you want to know? No, I, I, I don't, but sure. I didn't see very well. Well, then don't say you know, you lying kid. But the perpetrator was definitely much smaller than the cello. Let me look at the sheet again. Well, the cello's big. I hope the small ones did it. I mean, alright, so it can't be like the contrabass or the tuba or the drum or the timpani or the xylophone. Yeah, you get it. You understand. You know what size means. Uh, I heard Oboe and Clarinet talk to each other. That they saw the perpetrator during the performance or something. So, oops. I have a violin. I don't know if that's relevant. Um, well, there's actually two violins there. So, what the f I forgot already. Oboe and Clarinet talk to each other. Are they even, like, oh yeah, they're next to each other. So if they saw the perpetrator, it would have to be someone, like, near them, maybe? I mean, I could just be making shit up, but it would make the most sense for it to be the flute, the trumpet, or the trombone. It's something I heard someone say, but it seemed that the perpetrator was to the left of the cello. Fucking everyone is to the left of the cello. Except the small ones. God damn it, small ones. You couldn't commit a murder if you tried. I thought that the perpetrator was one of the violins, but it seems like that's not it. Those two have an alibi, it was said. It was said. By who? I'm basing all of my fucking deductions on second-hand reasoning. The xylophone and the metallophone seem to be an item. Okay, who cares? Um, well, they're like touching in the picture, so sure. Anyway, so the oboe and the clarinet saw them. It's not one of the violins, it's to the left of the cello. So, 
it's narrowed down to the flute, the viola, the trombone, and the trumpet, but I don't know. Or the symbol, I guess it could be the symbol. Um, but how can I fucking, how can I narrow it down any further than that? This is the one that was killed. Yeah. Because, you know, instruments bleed. So, viola, flute, trumpet, trombone. I'll just try them all, it's whatever. No, not that one. Viola, yeah, sure, try that one. Well, it wasn't that one. I mean, maybe there's more clues in this room that I'm missing. But I'm pretty sure it doesn't matter. I think I can just keep guessing and it's fine. As long as I keep talking to Chloe. Because I don't know if I made that clear before, but she restores your health whenever you talk to her. There's not that many opportunities to get hurt without just straight up dying, though. Well, it's not the contrabass. Did I check this one? No, it's just the second violin. I think I didn't check it because I assumed that. It's not the harp. It's not the flute. Wait, it's not the flute, right? What, what were the other things that I said? Oh, it could be the flute, yeah. I mean, I, I don't know, but it could be. God damn it. I guess I got lucky on that bear part. Which was good, because if I died in that part, I would have had to fucking load, but... Oh, look, I lost less health that time. I've been getting, uh... Either that means I'm getting closer, or I'm just getting resistant to failure. He's like, well, I've been killed by ghosts a few times already. I'm, I'm used to it. Doesn't take away as many lives. Um, trombone or trumpet or cymbal. Or maybe the horn? I mean, the horn is smaller than the cello by a, by a decent margin. So, trumpet, trombone, or horn, I guess. Not the oboe. It's not the oboe! I already tried the trumpet, didn't I? That was the one that I tried in the very beginning, That wasn't it? Conductor. I mean, it could be the conductor, right? I'm gonna try that one. Uh oh. Man, I thought I was so clever. I was like, ah! <gasps> The conductor could do it because the conductor's a living person and not an instrument and they could commit murder because they have hands and a brain and like the ability to commit things. Wait, what? I don't what did I ask? Oh, I pet her head. Great. Is that how you respond when someone pets your head? You say, "What is it?" What? <laughs> I don't know. Um, small ones. What are small ones? Metalophone, no. Xylophone, no. Oh, this is this is fun. This is just the most riveting. Yeah, it's te it technically could be the symbol. It's not. Could have been. It's, it's not. So I'm sure this is. I'm sure this is really fun to watch. I'm sure this is honestly like the most entertaining this game's been yet. I could actually make two guesses without dying, but like, I don't want to fucking risk it. I want to just make sure I heal each time. That's just kind of how I am in games. I'm always doing that. Um, like whenever I play first person shooters, which is not super often, but when I do, I reload. Even if I only shot like one bullet, I will reload immediately afterwards because I can't not. What the fuck? What was that even? Trombone and... Yeah, yeah, okay. So it's one of these. It has to be. Um, but I, I reload after every single shot. Because I can't deal with, like, not having it be full. And same thing with my health. Like, I'll wanna, I'll wanna heal until my health is full. Unless it's item-based. And then... <laughs> I mean, unless healing is item-based. Like, I've been playing Bloodborne. I said this already. Um, but, like... Um, healing is based on items. It wasn't either of those, so my entire reasoning is off, and I hate this puzzle. Anyway, um, you could, the only way to heal in Bloodborne is with items, and I've been, like, not healing, <laughs> um, because I need to keep my healing items at 99. 99 in storage and 20 on my person, and I will only heal if I absolutely need to. Like, 
I, I just I hate not having max items. It's it's really it's really a problem. Um, I'm gonna fast forward this because this is really fucking annoying, and all I've done this entire episode is check for these things. So uh, let's I'll see you when I find the culprit through sheer trial and error. <laughs> okay, so this time it might have actually been my fault. Maybe it wasn't the game's fault this time. Maybe I just didn't see that hammer sitting on the table and you had to pick up the hammer and then it gives you the option to destroy the locker. But, 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 but listen, listen. I figured <laughs> there's literally no excuse that I can come up with. Like, it was the first thing that was like visible in the room. It was a big, like, sharp-looking hammer sitting right on this table, like, should have been the first thing that your eyes go to. But I completely forgot it was there. And, yeah. Anyway... No, shut up. Don't call her a bother. That's mean. Look, I wasted, like, half an hour according to this save file. <laughs> Checked every single locker. I opened every single locker. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I got you. Oh, whoa. Something red and thick. I wonder what it is. Oh, this music's kind of freaking me out. Anyway, uh, next time, we're gonna explore the father's room, and hopefully not get stuck on a puzzle for half an hour? I really hope so. Good night. <laughs>